I drink coffee every morning and it's something I can't live without. Drinking coffee has many benefits for your health. For example, coffee can help people feel less tired and increase energy levels. Many studies show that coffee improves brain function such as memory, mood and reaction times. Several studies also show that coffee drinkers have a much lower risk of type 2 diabetes. Coffee drinkers have a much lower risk of getting Alzheimer's disease and developing depression. But there are also a few negative effects of coffee. For example, caffeine can greatly reduce the amount and cause your sleep. Many people also report that caffeine increases their anxiety levels. For some people, caffeine is also a major trigger for headaches. Moreover, caffeine can stain teeth and it can cause gradual tooth decay. But the reason I started considering of quitting coffee is that it's highly addictive. Personally, if I don't drink coffee in the morning, I feel so sluggish and drowsy all day. I just can't get anything done. And being completely dependent on a substance to function normally sounded a little bit scary. Around the same time recently, I started seeing lots of ads about matcha green tea on my Facebook and Instagram. Matcha green tea is essentially finely ground powder of specially grown and processed green tea leaves. Traditionally in Japan, matcha is served in tea ceremonies, but nowadays it's often used to flavor foods like ice cream and snacks, as well as drinks. Matcha has various health benefits. For example, matcha is high in antioxidants called catechins. Antioxidants help stabilize harmful free radicals, which are compounds that can damage cells and cause chronic disease. So having matcha daily can help prevent cell damage and even lower your risk of several chronic diseases. Similar to coffee, matcha can also improve brain function such as attention, memory and reaction time. Some studies also show that matcha could prevent liver damage and decrease the risk of liver disease. Additionally, drinking green tea is associated with reduced risk of heart disease and stroke. Finally, studies show that it may help you lose weight by speeding up metabolism to increase energy expenditure and boost fat burning. As I grew up in Japan, I used to drink a lot of matcha green tea because I could get it very easily. But since I moved to the UK, I stopped drinking because I couldn't find any matcha here. So I really missed it and when I saw these ads, I thought I'd give it a go and see if they're any good as a coffee alternative. The one I got is called Pure Chimp. It costs about £10 but you can get two for £15 and they have student discounts as well. I really like this because it's very easy to make. You just have to put some matcha powder into your mug, pour some boiled water and I usually add a bit of coconut milk. Hey guys, so it's been about a month without coffee, but I feel great with this matcha green tea. Um, if you're interested, I leave the link to the website in the description below. I think this is a really good coffee alternative if you're thinking of quitting coffee, but honestly, coffee is great. It has lots of health benefits uh, as much as matcha. So I think it's totally up to your preferences or taste. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please like it or subscribe to my channel. I'd be really grateful. So see you in the next video. Thanks.